Today at City Hall, family and friends of a bail bondsman who was beaten to death earlier this week gathered at Sacramento City Hall demanding change. 56 year old Kevin Brace worked at Greg Padilla bail bonds. Officers responded to the area just after four Monday morning for reports of an assault. Brace was the victim. He died at the scene. 38 year old Jacob Mandel is charged with his death and today Topo Padilla blamed Sacramento City leaders for making downtown Sacramento unsafe. He says City Hall needs to do more to support police. Our city leaders need to take those earmuffs off and start listening. But who they do listen to, who they do listen to with fear and fever are the people who protest on these streets, who carry signs, who bang pots, who don't leave, who sleep in tents and, until they get their way. And I'm not talking about homeless people. The, the activists, they get their way. And who doesn't? are people like these folks behind me who go to work, who take care of their children, who go to school. They don't get their way. The city of Sacramento sent out a statement today saying in part, quote, we want to express our deepest sympathies to the family, co-workers and friends of Kevin Brace. Such a crime should never occur anywhere. The ongoing investigation into the circumstances of this brutal killing will shed more light on what happened. Padilla says he will be at Tuesday's city hall meeting to bring his concerns directly to the mayor and city council members.